Once you have got your line drawing all completed, um, the next step is to paint it. So you will need your paintbrush, you will need a pot of water, and you will need a palette to mix your colours in. And we're going to need primary and secondary colours. So the first thing you need to do is on your palette, you are going to put some red, some yellow, and some blue. And you don't need a lot of each colour. In between taking the colour from the pot, you should wash the brush. And then you can press the brush on the edge of the water pot like this to remove any excess water and then take your next colour. Again, wash that brush in between. And it's a good idea to have some tissue so you can clean the brush really carefully in between taking each colour. So on your palette, you've got red, yellow, blue and white. Okay, now we have our primary colours, but we're going to mix some secondary colours. So I'm going to begin by mixing some orange, which means I need to take some yellow, clean that brush, dry it, take some red. And then I can mix those together to make orange. You may find you need a little bit of extra water. Okay, and now I have orange on my palette as well. The next secondary colour I'm going to mix is going to be green. So I will take some blue and I will take some yellow. Okay, so on my palette now, I have green, orange, yellow, blue and red to use for my painting. I also have a white so I can mix lighter and darker versions of each of these colours. Now the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to paint in the sea and the way we're going to do that is we're going to use blue but we're also going to mix in white to do some different shades of blue. So I'm going to start with the darkest blue at the top and then I'm going to add some white each time so that I get darker, bl lighter blue as I go down. Now I'm going to add some white into that blue to make it a bit lighter.
Okay, now we add some more white to get an even lighter blue. Okay, and finally, more white, so I've got my lightest blue at the bottom. Okay, so now I've got my different shades of blue. Okay, so now I've got different tints of the colour blue. It's going from my dark blue through to my light. And now I'm going to use the same light blue to paint in the sky. So now I have painted all of the blue areas of the painting.